Hey guys, it's Brie. I first and foremost want to point out the New Orleans Saints shirt. We won again today. Who dat? Go Saints! And my Louisiana necklace because I love it and I love being a 504 girl. With that being said, go Saints one more time. Um, I haven't done a video in a while, but I have done so much shopping. Seriously, my credit cards are crying. Um, look, my boyfriend's calling me. Kyle Butler, if anyone's a Dexter fan, that's his name in my phone. Because, I don't know, I like having my boyfriend's name as a serial killer in my phone. That makes no sense. That makes me seem really freaky. I'm a weird kind of girl, though, so... If you know me, I guess that makes sense. But back to the original point, my credit cards are seriously like, <gasps> Stop charging! And I uh, need to listen to my credit cards and stop charging. Oh well, I've gotten a lot of really cool stuff, and you get a lot of cool reviews. So, free, stop charging, so we get reviews on makeup. My favorite thing, I'm going to go straight into it, are the Disney villains. Maleficent, oh my gosh. So I've never been a Disney kind of kid. I have never liked cartoons. In fact, I kind of despise cartoons. If I ever have children, I will read to them and make them go to theater and go to museums and educate them. I will not put them in front of television to watch mindless cartoons. With that being said, I've never had respect for Disney princesses. I don't like princesses. I'm not all about, oh, come save me. Oh, my gosh. No. Villains totally rock. I was telling my friend earlier today, Cruella would put her cigarette out in Cinderella's eye and say, run in glass slippers, bitch. Go. I don't know why. I just made Cruella to Bill ghetto. Maybe a Cruella were from New Orleans. That's how she talk. I don't know. But anyway, I love smoky eyes. Everyone knows that I'm dark and sinister, even though I don't look like it on the outside. There's something very dark and evil on the inside of me. And that's not an exorcist reference. Please do not send a young priest and an old priest to my house. I don't need you. But I really like the smoky eye. I'm going to show you what I have going on here. And P.S. Back to New Orleans reference. The new Disney villain line has a color called French Quarter. OMG, and it's black and gold, but I didn't get that one, but I'll explain why. So, uh, my friend Jenny Groves and I had a complete girl day, and we sort of stumbled into MAC, and this girl started just putting makeup on us, and I fell in love with this whole look. This color is called Slick Black, and it's a grease paint stick, and what I do is just take the lid and color 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 black 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 but not all the way up that's more of a nightwear thing I've been wearing this all day and then I just make it more dramatic for night in fact in my last video I use the color scene and I just sort of blend that upward but since I don't want it to be too dramatic because I work in this I use this bare minerals purple color it's called cherish and I use it as my highlighter and that sort of brightens it up and makes me look less evil see it's like pinky purple I can't tilt it towards the keyboard or I will have powder all over which I have done before but you do that you do your little graft black blend 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 that is my best advice for that. And then I take this little Maleficent color. It's actually called She Who Dares. Check out this beautiful color. Those sparkling top notes right there. This really is magic. You have to see it in the light. I don't know. Buy it. If they still have it. I know they're selling out like everywhere. But it's greens and blues and it sparkles. And this makeup lasts all day. I put this on at 6 a.m. And let's check the iPhone. It is 828, and my makeup still looks like this. And Jenny wanted an eyeliner. And as you know, I am a hardcore fan of engraved, and she likes a crank, not a pencil. And I thought she was pretty crazy for just wanting a crank. So I was like, whatever. I love Jenny. Jenny has style. You should meet her. She should do YouTube videos, but she doesn't. Mm -hmm. So, this one is called Graph Black. 
It's engraved, but a crank. That's what the Mac person said. And this is what I have on, and I actually love it. Jenny was right. Jenny's always right. Do you have that friend that gives you advice, who tells you not to date this certain boy, or not to go to this party, and you're like, oh man, she was right, but I don't want to tell her? She doesn't really watch my videos, so she'll probably never see this, but Jenny's always right, and that sucks. Because she always has that I told you so look about her. So, Jenny Groves, you're always right. And I got a new mascara. This is Go Go Get One Give One Josie Marin. I don't know what this Get One Give One is all about. I should research it, but honestly, I don't care. It's probably for some charity or something. Whatever. I think it looks pretty. See? Dramatic. It stays on all day, it doesn't flake buy it. I'm sure there's some cause it promotes. I really honestly don't care. I should care, but whatever. And then in the last video, I talked about how there was some stupid blush that I wanted that was selling out. Well, I bought it. <laughs> kind of a mistake. I tried it on in the store and I was like, oh my god, this is the best thing ever. It's really not the best thing ever. It's Stila, and it's this custom color blush. It looks like this, but it doesn't really look like that when it goes on. I don't like it. I thought it was really gonna custom, and it doesn't. It lies to me. So, fail for Stila blush. But on an upper note, win from MAC Viva Glam Cindy Lauper. This is the best red. And since it's a Viva Glam, it goes towards AIDS research. And AIDS research, I do care about. And I really I don't care about all these things that go for breast cancer and things like that. I don't know anybody with it. Maybe I would be more sympathetic if I did. But I do know people that are affected with AIDS. And I've seen what people go through. And... This lipstick gloss actually goes towards something that I know and care about and I'm involved with. So go buy this if you care about AIDS and AIDS research and things like that. And it looks fabulous on. In fact, I'll put some on right now. I'm kind of against a smoky eye and red lips together. I think you should do one thing dramatic and not both. But I just want you to see how amazingly fabulous this is. Check it out. Do, do, do. Shade, shade, shade. And it's not too dark that you can't wear it everywhere. What I like to do is pair this one with see through. And actually, Britney Spears has been quoted that see through is her favorite lip gloss from MAC. I don't think that blended very well. Whatever. And I also have fallen in love with a few new nail polishes. This is a dark purple. Can you tell? Look, I have nails and they're done. Are you proud of me? And the color is called Just a Little Dangerous. How cute is that and how appropriate is that for me, right? And it's dark purple. I love dark shades. You can't tell. There we go. Boom. Purple. I like dark shades and dark colors. And I also wanted to be a little weird and different. And because I'm obsessed with the show Cabaret, I really, really wanted a green nail polish because Sally Bowles has some line in the show about being... She says, I'm strange and extraordinary and I wear green nail polish. So here's the green that I got. It looks like Wicked Green. And it's called Leaf Him at the Altar. And my last color I bought just because of Dexter. In this season, Dexter's been wearing only lavender shirts. Has any other freak noticed this? And this color is called the color to watch. Watch this color on Dexter because this is all Dexter wears is this color. So those are my three new weird colors. These two are Sephora colors. And this one is in everything. I think it's a part of the Iceland... Poland, I don't know. There's some new thing that it's out with. So there you go. Oh, and I only have a few more minutes left, but my boyfriend bought me these really awesome boots. Check that out. 
at Aldo and they actually fit me. For some weird reason they have very small sizes that fit my little feet and I can never find like adult shoes to wear since my feet are so small. So here they are. They're beautiful and my boyfriend surprised them for me with them. That's not even a sentence. My boyfriend surprised me with them and I think they're absolutely fabulous. So uh, this video is already running over. But try this fabulous smoky eye and buy the French Quarter one. I liked it. I thought it was a little too light. That's why I went with the Graph Black. No, is it the eyeliner? That's why I went with the darker shade. But try things and I really, really love the Villain Collection. So I would say buy everything and it, I didn't have any more money because I went on a shopping spree with Jenny. And I'm going to have to talk about clothes. I haven't done a clothing haul, and I've been on three. So I'm going to include that in the next video. But, yeah, I do answer all my messages. So holla back, girls. See you later.